right, Playmakers top 10. All right, so at number 10, we got Jamire Chase. This play was on third and nine, ended up going 51 yards to the house. This one actually broke the game wide open. And my opponent, he actually just gave up on the play. He was like, yo, I'm not even going to chase him. So when they don't even want to chase you, you already know it's going for six points. All right, so number nine, we have Playmakers League. This is uh, the Browns free safety Tart. Now Tart, they try him, he picks it off, and this is gonna be a pretty easy walk-in pick six from about 25 yards out. Nothing major, right? But the very next play, they try him again. And in consecutive plays, he's gonna get 14 points in basically like a 15 second time span. That sequence actually got him player of the week. So we have a bonus at number eight. So watch the guy right there that circled on the left side of the screen. Now this playmaker that I'm going against, he kind of got a little laugh out of me calling myself a defensive player. And sometimes you actually just gotta let them know. You can't just talk that shit in the chat. I read this screen from a mile away and I hauled ass and I beat that, I beat his running back to the spot. So nothing major, but sometimes again, you just gotta, gotta remind them. Number eight, we have CD Lamb from the Cowboys. And if you look at this, he just manages to tap both feet in the back of the end zone for the six points. But on a second look, that user free safety uh, is supposed to have the deep middle responsibility when he gets caught chasing those shallow routes across the middle. You'll get them every time. But for number seven, we're going to keep it in Dallas. Now, check out Pilot right here with this little stutter step. <laughs> what is he diving at? And he is off to the races, 68 yards. You're not catching that, man. But if we actually play it back, it was the little breathing stop right here where he lets up off the gas, turns a little bit, and then accelerates full speed. Nice move. All right, so at number six, it's uh, the Hitman. So I end up blocking this field goal, and I'm thinking everything is going my way, and we lose connection. So as soon as we restart, here we go with Zach Wilson. And this is the absolute dime. He's fading back to the right, throws it cross field to the left. Absolute dime. And just take another look at it. He has pressure right in his face, and it didn't matter. Perfect pass. So I got to give him credit. So at number five, I'm starting to notice a trend. Uh, this one is also against me. Um, so I'm the butt of the jokes here. I thought I had the pick and Tyler Higby is just running over folks. Like, and he takes this 63 yards. I'm not even sure how he actually did this, but looking at the replay, I really thought I had that pick. And then I missed the strip and he stiffs on me, runs another dude over and to the house. Number four is Scary Terry with run and the commanders. And he's going to take this 70 yards to the house to basically put the game out of reach. Now, take a look. He did not click on with the user defender. Computer will get beat this year. Number three, we have JP and Josh Allen. So he's rolling out, scrambling to the left, sidearms it against the grain back to the right. Uh, that's what a 99 throw power QB can do for you. Not even the acrobat could defend a perfect pass. Number two, this is run with the commanders. And check this out. From about the 35-yard line, fading away he just flicks it and it actually crosses the goal line so that's nearly 70 yards in the air just flicks the wrist and i couldn't even make this play in 20 yards that traveled 70 yards in the air amazing and at number one i got joe mixon this is going to be an off tackle to the right quick stutter step right there didn't like it cut back to the left juke excellent block by jamar chase and 61 yards later he is gone now, what made this a little bit more sweet is because this dude talked so much shit and he actually couldn't say anything after the game. Actually, I didn't even have to say a word after the game, but the only thing that made this play not as special is the game didn't save. Um, thank you, EA.